here we go. Here is the USA long cards for the Hot Wheels Basics. I already did an L case. I already did an L case video of the uh, worldwide assortment. So let's just get right to it and see how much this parallels. Should be the same. Looking forward to the uh, Pagani. Pagani was in the L case, I believe, for my worldwide. So I would expect it to be in here as well. Take a little look. Let's get going. Nice release. Nice classy design. Got your tail, tail light tempos. Got some tempos for the front too, it looks like. Accurate NSX. Give you a peek. Now with the uh, worldwide cases, I'm not I don't show the back because the information's not on the back. There's your new for 2013. The second color, I'm gonna have to move this because I got a shadow right here. Hold on, let me figure out, let me figure out what's going on here. So there you go, Max Steel. High voltage back. Very nice. Somebody asked me about the uh, VW bug, if it had gone to plastic, and it looks like it's still metal. Looking at the rivets, got a metal rivet, metal rivet, so that body should be metal. So it's uh, thankfully still a metal body, metal base. Not too many of those left in the $1 basic lineup. Very glad to get another Batmobile. That's not a new model, that was out a long time ago. Diesel Boy in Green reissue. I already showed you this one here. Nice paint job on the uh, Camaro convertible. Some uh, that looks a little high. I have to, I'm gonna hold this one aside to see if there's an error on that. If it's supposed to be popping further. But uh, someone said, uh, you know. Why don't I like convertibles? I just, you know, I like some convertibles, but I don't like having a lot of convertibles. You know, this one looks pretty good. I think the convertibles that I don't like are kind of the ones that are the early 70s cars that had the white fenders. It looks kind of silly to me. I don't know. There you go. Fast and Furious. Nice to see the basic issues. I think, uh, I wonder if uh, some people are wondering if the uh, hood pins are going to be painted on some of the basics too because the Walmart Fast and Furious line had um, little dots for, I think, hood locks. I think that's what they would be. Pins. Corvette Stingray. Custom Galaxy. Not a whole lot of room for the uh, temples on the uh, tail of the Corvette Stingray, that's for sure. Purple Passion. I think it's already a uh, second month for that. Love it, love it, love it. Sorry if I went too fast for the name. Now this L case right now is showing up at Walmart stores. It's showing up in a Walmart store. So uh, when L cases hit your stores, it doesn't have to be Walmart. They could be anywhere. But right now this is what's showing up late May 2013. Here's a new model, Time Tracker. I, I look forward to giving that one a uh, some time in the boosters. Obviously, just looking at it. There you go. There you got the uh, Pagani Huero for the uh, Huero. El Gringo Me Gusto, the uh, Huayra, or whatever. You guys can argue how to say it. I just like to collect toy cars. Glad to get three because there was only one. There was only one in my international case. So I didn't, I didn't want to open it up if, if it was the only Pagani that I was going to get. So I did not, uh, now I can open it up, not today. Let me give you a look, sorry. I should have kept it close. 
give you a look at the uh, tail for those of you who do not see did not see it in my uh, other video got some nice uh, tampos on the tail it's not uh, just black this piece right here looks it looks gray plastic I don't think that's paint right there that must be must have a gray interior with dark windows yep this one might uh, work in the boosters too here's some more uh, kid friendly cars you got the uh, twin duction and the armor truck and this one's just kind of nice did this one did this one show up in the fast and the furious line too I know there was a Mustang I don't I don't know if it was that one can you see any red cars down here nope nothing to compare it to so I don't know maybe this is just maybe it's just uh, popped up a little bit the uh, the interior okay let's see let's try some orange fast and furious there you go Supra Toyota Supra this one this one definitely got some nice treatment on the uh, Walmart exclusives uh, I have not been able to find them but someone is hooking me up I forget two people actually messaged me and said hey can they help me get something and uh, they wanted to send it uh, and says okay so you know I send them the money and the stuff's on the way I uh, I'll show those in a video later as far as other people they're not sending it to me for free they're they're sending me something that I was not able to find on my own and you know most of the time I would have just waited I mean I'm in no hurry I've been in this hobby 15 years uh, I can wait if I don't find them fast and the furious I can wait I can get them later same wheels, same wheels, no errors. I can wait, I'm not in a hurry. But they said that uh, somebody's going to help me with the Fast and the Furious and then somebody else is going to help me out with another set. So I said, alright. So I sent them the money, pay for shipping. Thank you for uh, helping me out. That's very kind of you. And that'll be coming up. Those people who have like extra cars and they just want to share, you know what? Please share with uh, needy organizations in your area because that's the same thing I do here. I help out uh, needy, needy organizations in my area. Wow, this thing's got tampons on the, the top, the sides. This one got some extra nice treatment. Nothing in the front. That's all right. So I help my charities in my area because it's uh, cost efficient. I just uh, go over there, drop off the cars, and we're done. If I have to ship cars to somebody to help them out, that's kind of not very cost efficient. So, you know, help people in your area. And I will do the same. I don't think this focus was in my case actually, in the L case. So let's go ahead and take a look at it. Got some nice, uh, pretty wild graphics on there. Different color wheel. Got a green wheel, green wheel in the back, silver chrome in the front, silver chrome, green. So that's how it's supposed to be issued. Don't let nobody fool you into thinking that's an error. Not an error, obviously. If it's on a card. Now, you know, sometimes the card doesn't match the car, but in this case, it does match and it's supposed to match. You guys already seen the treasure hunt, right? I went right by it just to see if you guys are paying attention. I'll show it again at the end. Yep, I like this. Nice color. Don't like a lot of yellow cars, but that one looks good. And I think someone told me that it was an error proper error up uh, error correct that they actually did release it nice to see the uh, this car what do they call that twins before and after what do they call it then and now nice to see this uh, this this release to go along with the uh, older Mustang which was in this case as well no tampos on the tail Where'd you go? Where'd you go? There you go. Mustang. Mustang. Then and now series. There you go. Gave them uh, correlating paint jobs. Nice. Kind of nice. I'm sure most of you would have picked up both of them anyways. And not uh, and not picked them up just to, so that you'd have the set, set, the pair. You'd probably pick them both up anyways. 
There you go. Baja Bone Shaker. I don't remember this blue one being in the last case. It could have been there. I just don't remember. Uh oh, getting down to uh, six cars left. And I seen a bunch of white combis. Can you see? I seen a bunch of white combis, but I don't I might not get a super again. So fine torque twister. Mixed wheels again. Let's check the card. Mixed wheels, yellow, green. Love this wagon. Let's see, what do we have here? We have a uh, Ford Ranchero. Mm, I think that one's a Super, isn't it? I could be wrong. Not Super all of them, but I think that isn't, isn't that the one that there could be a Super Treasure, huh? This one is not. Got regular wheels. You got your uh, PR5s, which I sometimes goof up and call them PR10s. Because they got the 10 spokes. And last but not least, we have the... Uh, Combis and another El Camino. There you go. Cool combi. Definitely nice color. I wonder how many repaints they are going to do of that model. I'll get uh, I'll get a couple of each color. Well, I didn't get the I didn't buy any extras of the orange one. Green one. I got some when I was in uh, Indiana. Found some in the store over there, so I did buy some of the that one. But otherwise, the uh, orange one, no thanks, don't need extra. Here you go, here's the treasure hunt, if you didn't notice. Treasure hunt that was in this case. There's not one in every case. And see here on the back, you got your uh, treasure hunt flame logo. There's your designation. And then uh, behind the car, on the U.S. cars, it says, it says this, let's see. I don't know if you can see it better over here. Oh! 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 There you go. This symbol on the vehicle lets you know it's a hard to it's hard to find and highly collectible. There's your uh, basic treasure hunt. Thank you once again for joining me for another uh, case code uh, video. I preach. Hang on, I gotta fix it. Gotta make it all nice, right? Collectible. You gotta take care of your collectibles. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.